Milestones are really just a simple point in time where you stop and evaluate your project and make sure that it is on track. And so we're going to take a look at milestone tracking and, and milestones in this product, Standard Time. If you're familiar with Standard Time, you'll know that it is primarily a timesheet product. You see the six tabs along the top here, and we have the timesheet chosen. There's obviously a lot more you can do with Standard Time, which includes the milestones in project tasks. So I'm going to click on the project tasks tab and take a look at how we got these milestones and tasks into the timesheet. So here you're seeing a list of all of my projects and we're actually going to look at just one of these projects. So I think what I'll do is go over here and filter the project tasks section so that we see just this project. And here you're seeing a few tasks, a very simple project here with just a couple of tasks and some milestones. This is my My Milestones project, which I set up for just this video. We switch back over to the timesheet, we see that project here, and we see the same tasks and milestones. So obviously, if they're sitting here in the timesheet, I can go in and type hours in for those tasks and milestones if I wanted to. Now, again, normally milestones are not something you would track time to. Normally they are a point in time where you simply stop and reevaluate the project and say, are we on track? Are we going to finish on time? Now you may have some tasks mixed into that as well as the actual milestones. In the olden days, uh, milestones were really these stone obelisks that were set up next to the road and uh, you would walk from town to town or, or drive your buggy from town to town, your horse, and you would see these stone obelisks and you would know that you had gone one mile. So if it was 10 miles to the next town, you know, you simply count 10 of those stone obelisks and you would know that the next town was uh, coming up shortly. And that's a lot like it is in, in projects. You have these points in time where you kind of know where you are in the project. You can tell that you've gotten a certain amount finished on the project and they represent just sort of a stopping point, a point in time that you can take a look at your project and make sure that you're really that far along on the project. So uh, here we've got a few and if I were to right click on one of these I could create a new one by choosing new project task. Turns out that milestones are really just project tasks with a zero duration. So I'm going to name this Milestone 4. Of course, you can use any name you like. These are really just the events that you would be checking your project. You can see that this is assigned to my little project here. I'm going to give it a start date. And I'll give it a zero duration because that defines a milestone as opposed to a project task. And then this milestone is going to be assigned to all users. Of course, you could assign it to different users who might be working on different parts of the program so that they would see their milestones as opposed to other people. So go ahead and click Save and Close, and you can see that the Gantt chart has slid out to include that extra time. I go over to the timesheet, and you see that milestone there. Now again, we said that um, often milestones are not something you actually track time to. You track time to tasks. The milestones are more used for just evaluation points, or sometimes go, no-go decisions. So I'm going to go ahead and just unselect some of these quick task checkboxes, and when we go over to the timesheet, you now see that you have just the tasks. So that is a way for you to hide those and use those just as evaluation points. Now what you could do is put a reminder on each one of these so they pop up for you and that would allow you to check your project uh, to make sure that it's on track. If I were to let's say right click on one of these and choose delete you can uh, watch the Gantt chart here slide back to include just the time that would be in included on all of these uh, tasks and milestones.